I just went ahead and milled up a somewhat square piece of wood out of a piece of American elm, and this will be my blank. Now, I know nothing about dance or feet stretching, but my sister is a very good ballerina, and she told me she wanted one of these. So you can see here, the ballerina's foot just sits inside these curves, and you can stretch out your muscles in your feet. Believe it or not, these things actually sell for over $100, and... From a purely woodworking point of view, it's nothing more than a board with a couple curves in it. The challenging part is, I couldn't find measurements or patterns for this guy anywhere, so I'm just going to sort of eyeball the scale of this and hope that it works. bandsaw for like that long ever that took forever okay I'm just going to draw on a very simple little pattern so it doesn't look so chunky okay let's go cut that out <laughs> sanding and shaping at the belt sander and at some point I'm going to swap out for the spindle sander to get inside the tighter curves. stretcher I put on three coats of lacquer to seal everything in and you know what I'm just not happy with this there are tool marks everywhere because sanding this was a pain this in my opinion is not a very pretty piece of wood and I really screwed up on the handle here so I went back and I made a second one these are just three two by fours laminated together and I use two by fours because it's very soft wood and it's easy to work with and I was very careful while sanding this to make sure all tool marks and weird bumps and ridges are out. I also added a 3 8 inch round over on every edge. And I used my table saw to shape the handle instead of freehanding that on a bandsaw. And in my opinion, this one is easily 10 times better than the other one. All that's left to do now is finish this, and I'm going to be using lacquer. I usually spray on about 3 to 5 coats of lacquer until I get a nice solid film over all surfaces. <laughs> So here's my finished foot stretcher. I think I finished on the fifth coat of lacquer and it's just a beautiful surface. So anyways, I hope you all enjoyed the video and please, I really want to ask all of you individually to subscribe to my channel. I'm somewhere around 1,400 subscribers. I'd like to get that number a little bit bigger. So if you haven't already, just below this where it says Peter Matthew, the red button that says subscribe, click that. That way you'll always be notified when I upload a new video and it helps me out a lot. Give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. Go in the comments, share any feedback or thoughts you might have. And tune back in next Friday for a new video on this channel, and I will see you all then.